Hey what's up guys, David here from Dignited. Today I want to show you how you can sideload apps or install apps from third party sources on your Amazon Fire Stick or Fire TV. Alright, let's get into it. There are several apps on the Amazon App Store, however your favorite app may not be listed on the official store. For instance, Kodi or the DSTV app are not listed on the Amazon App Store. This could be because of geo restrictions or because the vendor simply didn't release a Fire TV version of their app. Now, sideloading apps means installing apps that are not available on the official Amazon store. Alright, installing apps from third-party sources is not supported by default, so you'll have to enable installing apps from unknown sources in the developer options menu. Now, before June 2022, Amazon kept the developer options menu visible by default. However, it's now hidden after Amazon pushed out a software update. But you can still activate the developer options options menu. To do that, go to settings and then my Fire TV and then about and then select your Fire TV name or model and then press it seven times. When you do this, you'll see a countdown at the bottom telling you when the menu will be unlocked. Now head back one screen to my Fire TV page and you'll see the newly unhidden developer options menu. Alright, under developer options, you'll see two entries, ADB debugging and install unknown apps. These are essentially the two ways of sideloading apps on the Amazon Fire Stick. Now, when you turn on ADB debugging, you will install an app remotely using your phone or PC via Wi-Fi or USB cable. ADB or Android Debug Bridge is a programming tool used for debugging Android-based devices. It's mostly used to install apps remotely on the Amazon Fire Stick. All right, now when you enable install unknown apps, you'll be able to install apps directly on your Fire Stick. Some apps such as the downloader app enable you to directly download an app's apk file through its built-in browser then using the installer you can install the app directly to your fire stick all right now let me show you how to install apps directly to your fire stick using the downloader app the downloader app has a built-in browser, a file manager, and an app installer. You can install it directly from the Amazon App Store. So to get it, go to your Fire TV and then tap on Find and then go to Search and then enter Downloader and then tap on Get. All right, you can also use your Alexa remote to search and install the downloader app. All right, with the downloader app now installed on your Fire Stick, the next step is to now allow apps to be installed from unknown sources using downloader app. Now, to do that, uh, simply go to settings and then come to My Fire TV, developer options, and then install unknown apps and then select downloader here. So turn it on to allow downloader to install other apps that are not from the app store. You can now return to the downloader app and you can search for the app that you wish to sideload or enter a direct URL or enter downloader shortcodes. Now, downloader shortcodes are numerical numbers that are like shortcuts to various popular apps that people are sideloading on their Fire Stick. So this is actually a much shorter and more convenient way of uh, installing apps using the downloader app. All right, so I'm going to enter my numeric shortcode here. All right, and as you can see, it's uh, downloading the app directly now to the Fire Stick here. Just tap on install there, and I'm now installing this app directly to the Amazon Fire Stick. Now, to launch the app, you can just launch it the way that you do with the other apps. Simply come to the app launcher here, and then come to my apps. And then you should be able to see your newly sideloaded app right here. So just tap on it and it will just start like any other app. The second way to sideload apps is remotely using your computer or Android phone. We shall use the apps to fire app for this. With this app, you can install any app already installed on your phone to your Fire Stick, or you can also install an app APK file you have downloaded to your phone. All right, Fire TV is loosely based on Google's Android operating system, so technically all apps that run on Android or Android TV can run on Fire Stick. So go ahead and download it from the Google Play Store 
Store. All right, before you start the app to fire up, make sure your phone and Fastic are connected to the same Wi-Fi network. This will help the app to fire automatically discover your Fire Stick. You also want to take note of your Fire Stick's IP address. You will need it when connecting to Fire Stick remotely over an Android smartphone or Windows PC. All right, to check your Fire Stick's IP address, go to Settings and then My Fire TV and then About and then scroll to network. You should be able to see your Firestick's IP address there. All right, start the apps to fire up here and then come to setup here. And then here you can enter the IP address of your Firestick directly or you can just tap on search Fire TVs here. So if your Fire TV and your smartphone are on the same Wi-Fi network, your Fire TV should be discovered. As you can see, it has already seen my Fire Stick here and I'm just going to tap on it. Apps to Fire will attempt to connect to your Fire Stick and if successful, you should see this pop-up on your Fire Stick that allow USB debugging. So just tap on OK here to allow USB debugging. And yeah, now apps to fire is connected to your Fire Stick. Now I have a number of apps here installed on my smartphone that show up and I can just choose from any of these apps that I wish to install directly to my Fire Stick. So uh, let's just select this IDA64 app here and then just install it directly to the Fire Stick. It will take a few minutes as the apps to fire app attempts to upload and install the app that you've selected to your fire stick all right we have installation successful here so the ida 64 app is now installed on my fire stick so come to your fire stick here and then come to the apps launcher right here tap on my apps and then scroll down and find your newly side loaded app and as you can see i have the ida 64 app installed on my fire stick now, please note that sideloading apps has a security and privacy risk. Because the apps you're installing are not officially vetted by Amazon, you have to be careful where you download sideloaded apps. You may be installing malware or an app with malicious intent without knowing it. Also, apps might be streaming illegal content which can get you in trouble with law enforcement. All right, guys, uh, that's it. That's how you can sign load apps on your Fire Stick. I hope this video was helpful. If it was, go ahead and give us a like, subscribe to the channel, ring the bell icon so you don't miss out on future videos. Otherwise, I'll see you guys in the next one.